Hey guys, I'm Phil. Um, I am a somewhat new Poshmark reseller. My Poshmark name is Found by Phil. I also sell on eBay and I have an Instagram. Today I'm going to tell you about the B&G trading box I got on Monday. Um, I did the Revolve in Nordstrom Women's Premier Box assorted bundle. Everything was over $60 MSRP and I got 25 pieces. Um, I had a coupon code so the normal price was $2.99. I paid $2.25 plus $9 in tax and $36.50 of shipping. So the total was $2.70.50. And for 25 pieces, that brings my cost of goods to $10.82 each. For 25 pieces, all new with tags. Um, I think they don't guarantee everything is going to be new with tags. I think they say maybe one or two pieces won't be new with tags, but it will be new without tags. Again, these are all Revolve and Nordstrom brands. These are not brands that I usually sell because we don't have Nordstrom here in New York. Uh, well, we do now, uh, but it's very new. So there's not a lot of thrift stores, a lo not a lot of thrift stores have inventory of these um, brands and yeah, but I'm super excited for the most part with what I got and let's go through it. So I got a good amount of Michael Kors dresses and pants. Um, I wasn't super pumped about that because I know Michael Kors doesn't do as well on Poshmark and I've already listed all of these and I think the Michael Kors stuff hasn't gotten any likes or any traction yet. So I'm definitely going to have to cross list that to eBay, which is pretty easy. I could see these doing a lot better on eBay anyways. Um, the older customer seems to like Michael Kors and that customer is on eBay a lot of the times. So this is a Michael Kors kind of ruched front, shorter dress, um, size small, it is petite. That is one other thing I will say about this Michael Kors stuff is that it's all kind of weird sizing, um, but we'll see. Long term, these are white Michael Kors stretch pants, back pockets, no front pockets. Um, so the MSRP was 74 on these and these are 12P, also 12 petite. So I think that although these are great stretchy material and the stretchy fabric is definitely trending right now, um, the size may be a problem on these, but you never know, 12P needs, need clothes too. Um, this is a Michael Kors jersey maxi dress with tie back detail. I love the print on this. I think this is super wearable. This is an XL, that's great. And MSRP was 140 on this. I think that I can make money on this. I like it a lot and it's perfect for spring. So hopefully I can sell that quickly. Um, this is a long Michael Kors, Michael Kors black jersey dress, petite large. Um, MSRP is 140, it's been kind of scratched off. I think they're removing the discount tags off these at BNG Trading. Um, which is fine. I would have done the same anyways. So this has this lace up side detail and could be a good mother of the bride dress. Um, I'm not super in love with this, but especially the size makes, will make it difficult, but we will see. This is the only Tommy Hilfiger piece I got. It is an extra small petite. Um, so it's cute, pretty wearable. Um, long sleeve, ditzy little floral print on there, 70s style, the V Henley button front styling, um, ruched neckline. I don't sell, I haven't sold Tommy Hilfiger in the past, so I might have to do some target following for a lot of this stuff. Um, you know, look at the brands I haven't sold before and follow a lot of the people who have liked or purchased those brands in the sizes I have. That's done me well in the past when I have expanded into new brands. Um, this is one state. I'd never heard of this brand. I love this dress though. It's like a great pistachio color with ruffle sleeves and a cross front. Great snap detail there. Um, yeah, size small. That's great. MSRP 140. This is a midi length and super soft fabric. And I think that's awesome for spring and summer. This is a free people sweatshirt. It's pretty unique. I actually may steal this for myself. Uh, I love this color combination and it has kind of like inside out details. I did look 
they're actually, I think this was free people for the UK. You can look on the tag on the care label and you can see what was meant for UK. So it could be Nordstrom UK. I'm not totally sure, but it has these pockets and Rahem, olive color with mint, which can be kind of hard for some people to pull off. It's definitely oversized though, which is good. And this is a size large, which has an oversized look, super cute. We'll see if it doesn't sell, I'll keep it. I have no problem with that. <laughs> um, this is Jack by B, B Dakota, which a lot of people complain that there's a lot of this brand in these reseller boxes. And sorry, some, some of these hangers are, are mixed and matched. I ran out of hangers when I was hanging all this stuff up, but I only got two Jack by BB Dakota. I think this is cute. Short dress, royal blue color, V-neck, um, very flirty style. Uh, I love, I love the color and yeah, we'll see how saturated the market is with that. This is, I think Jack by BB Dakota size six. And this is like a super cool jumpsuit with a purple floral print tie front and it also has these flap legs um this is also perfect for spring and it has the snap button front closure so you can step into that and i like the keyhole back neck msrp is not listed for this but the tag is here and it's a size six this is joa uh just one answer a uh, mini, mini dress, asymmetrical. So this actually goes like that. I think this is really cute. I love the color. I love the print, great floral print, kind of vintage inspired and no MSRP on these. These must, I think these are Revolve brands. So maybe they don't put their MSRP on their hang tags. The only hang tag is the JOA hang tag. So this was initially a really, I was really excited to get this trench coat. Um, I could see this having a high resale value on it. However, I did notice some flaws, which must have been like in store or packaged. When it was packaged, it was flaws, or maybe it was in the factory. The fabric came out weird. I don't know if you can see that. There's some pick marks with the fabric. Um, so I don't think it's a major issue. It's kind of just the nature of this fabric that like pulled sometimes. So that's fine. I'm just going to call that out, but that will affect the resale value, obviously. But it's a size small, has pockets, belted tie front, cool snaps, which I'm noticing are not very secure on there. So cute. I think I'll definitely be able to make my money on that. This is Sanctuary. This is a cool long dress, polka dot, like jacquard style. Um, this is size zero. I like the color on this, and this also has the little snap front to keep you all secure there. And yeah, long sleeves with elastic hem. This is also Sanctuary. I try to keep everything in order by brand. Some may slightly be out of order. I'm working with not a lot of space here, so I do my best, but 600 square feet apartment. Um, I love this mini dress. It's like cold shoulder style with the sleeve detail, ruffle sleeves, a great like light blue baby blue baby blue color with floral print this is a size large this also doesn't have the msrp on it which is fine i don't list the msrp i know in poshmark you can list like what the original msrp is i don't really see any benefit in doing that and it kind of i don't know if people actually look at that if anybody has other suggestions with that and they have more luck listing the msrp let me know in the comments um, this is Free People embroidered top. I actually thought this was a mini, dre mini dress at first, but it is a top from the retail pictures I found online. I love the mesh embroidery, super soft fabric, long sleeve, detail at the back. I did notice we've got a hole. I don't know if you can see that there. So that's a pin size hole and that is on the front. So that will be a problem. Um, I did call it out when I listed it. It got some likes already immediately. However, I think as people read more into the details there and see the pictures, they may unlike or not buy. So we will see what happens with that. This is Lucky Brand long sleeve kind of peasant top with blue embroidery, 
size small, um, cute, $99. I think that's an easy sell, but the market may be pretty saturated with that. This is a Capulet like tie front blouse, or I guess it's like a, a robe. It's short though, shorter. Um, this Capulet doesn't put the sizes on the main label. It's next to the care label. This is an extra small. I love the print on this though. Citrus prints are trending and yeah, it's black. It's super cute. This is also Capulet. Um, I like this a lot. I already have some good likes from this on Poshmark. This is listed full button front, kind of a mid sleeve, not shorter sleeve, and it has button cuffs. So that's cute. If you're really intrigued by the Capulet, I'm not gonna reach in and try and find the size for all of it. It's in my Poshmark search Capulet. This is a bodysuit um, top. Thing. So it has the snap bottom, jersey snap bottom, long sleeve, and this also has a tie front so it can be more, worn multiple ways. I think this is super cute off-white print and floral print. And yeah, I like that a lot. Again, I'm new to a lot of these brands so I don't really know how they're going to do. Um, hopefully I can sell them quickly. This is ASTR, really cute lemon print, midi dress, jersey fabric. Or, I'm sorry, poplin fabric. Um, so this has ruffle sleeves, full button front, tie detail. Yeah, and I like that. That's a size medium. It's perfect for wedding season. Um, this is also ASTR. I really like this top. It's like very flirty, perfect for date night. Kind of a cold shoulder style. It actually goes like that. So with the elastic detail on the back and tie wrap front. That is a size extra small. This is JOA, just one answer. Um, mustard pencil skirt with button detail. And you, a lot of this stuff has like spare buttons and spare hook and eyes for replacement, which is great. And zippered back. I think that's cute. Um, this is Vince Camuto. I got three Vince Camuto pieces. I've never sold Vince Camuto. Um, I do know it's like everywhere and a lot of retailers. So initially I was kind of scared, but once I looked more into these items, I think I'll be able to make some money off of them. This is size six um, with the tie front. Cute, pretty wearable, great for work. MSRP 130. So yeah, easy. And this is Vince Camuto. It is like a chambray longer dress with ruffle sleeves and v-neck front with button full button front um i like the back on it too it's cool detail size medium msrp is 140 and it comes with the spare button which is always good this is vince camuto linen pants these are kind of specialty um i actually work in fashion and linen is kind of hit or miss and kind of markdown territory, we always call it, but that could be different on reselling platforms. These are a size extra small. I like the stripes. I think it's great for beach, super beachy style. There are no, oh, there are, are pockets, I'm sorry. There's no back pockets, but it's a lighter fabric, MSRP $99, and yeah, I think that's great. So, overall, I'm really happy with what I got. Um, we'll see what happens. I can do an update video if you guys want and tell you what sold in maybe like a month. Um, B&G was very responsive, I think. They shipped from California and I ordered my box on the 24th and it came just this past Monday on March 9th. So February 24th to March 9th, 13 days. It's a big box, um, $63 for shipping. I don't have the box here, but it is big and it is heavy, 25 items, yeah. Um, let me know if you have any questions and I'll be happy to answer any questions you have in the comments. Any suggestions you have, please let me know. I'm new to this and I want to do more, but I want them to be great. So just hit me up. Instagram, found by Phil. Poshmark, found by Phil. eBay, found by Phil. Thanks.